Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be sharing with you the symbol Pumpkin Spice Inspired Makeup Look. I hope you guys enjoy creating this look with me and let's get started. I'm starting it off by priming my eyes using my primer potion all the way to the brow bone and my lower lash line. Then I'm using a eyeshadow as a transition shade, dusting it from the outer corner inwards. This will allow all my other shadows to blend much smoother afterwards. Then I'm going in with this metallic copper shade and I'll be using my fingers to place it in the middle of my eyelid. I'm really packing this colour until it reaches the desired intensity that I want. I'm leaving the inner corner of my eyelids bare. Then I'm going in with this dark brown shade, focusing it on my outer corner and buffing it into my outer crease. Then I'm just going back in with the first shade to smoothen out any harsh edges by buffing along the lines in circular motions. Next, I'm going back in with this pumpkin shade and just placing the colour right above the brown colour and sweeping it in circular motions inwards slowly. I'm just building up the intensity of the orange to achieve that pumpkin spice look that I want. Then, I'm just going back in with a fluffy brush to blend it all out smoothly. This shimmery rose colour will be for the inner eyelid shade. So using a brush, I'm carefully placing it only on the inner corner of my eyelids, blending it slightly to the copper shade. I'm also using it to highlight my inner corners. I'm going in with a matte white eyeshadow using it to highlight my brow bones, making it more defined and arched. Then again with the pumpkin shade, I'm using it on my lower lash line and then afterwards going in with the dark brown again, layering over it. The liner, I'm just using a brown gel liner. As you can see my my as you guys can see my gel liner is actually running dry so I'm having a little difficulty and like fallouts while of during my application. But here I'm just actually creating a soft wing which is not too thick. Then I'm just going back in with a brush to smudge out the liner for a blunt out, a blur out effect. I'm also doing the same for the other eye. And over here I'm just clipping my lashes, putting on some mascara and then I also placed on some falsies. Onto the contour, I'm just using a cool tone bronzer to slim down my face by shading the sides of my jaw bones as well as my chin area. I'll just be slightly contouring my cheekbones out as well. I've been loving wearing my blush this way these days. I feel that it's really flattering and my face just appears slimmer. I'm actually choosing a muted mauve pink shade to dust right below my cheekbones. Just going back in to carve out my nose and do some highlighting to brighten up the face where light hits. I'm actually using my new MAC lipstick in the shade Craving and I'm really really loving it. I decided to apply it in a gradient manner so starting from inside, I'm actually using my fingers to press and slowly dab the colours outwards. And yay! I'm finally removing those hair colours. I love how the colours turn out. So pretty. And ta-da! My look is complete! I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye!